Happy Thumbs Gaming. We shall. Hey everybody, it's Jeremy from Happy Thumbs Gaming. Today we're working on trophy achievement wrecker for Battlefield 4. To get this one, you need to wreck a home and a family and ruin it. Just kidding. You actually just gotta get uh, 10 multi-kills. So I'm gonna show you multiple spots here to get them. Uh, this is the very first encounter you get right there. So off to the right, little grenade throw, easy little multi-kill. And then uh, just run over here, find this little bonus weapon. And then you can run up the stairs right here. That trophy is just for finding a bunch of stuff. There's definitely some uh, weapon glitches going on that we're trying to figure out what's the story with that. But uh, you can seem to collect them and they don't count and then they just keep stacking. So you, I don't know, we'll, we'll see how this goes as time goes on. Uh, running down the stairs, they're going to group up so you can throw one down here and get another one. Uh, don't worry if you miss one of these multi-kills, I'm going to show you uh, more than 10. And uh, there's definitely a couple opportunities just to really get at it. So. All right, now that you're running up these stairs right here, over to the left, there's gonna be a couple of groupings of enemies where you can throw grenades and get more uh, multi-kills. If you run out of grenades, just run over a dead enemy, you usually pick one up. Oop, a little turn around there. Boom, but not a multi-kill. But that's uh, where you'd get one at, and then uh, throwing one back into this window back here. Ah. And you can always just use the, uh, R2 or a, a right trigger for finding everybody with the visor, so definitely uh, check that out if you need to. But uh, pretty much that's a good thing. And then after you do that, up here there's a crate where you can get some claymores. And before this next wave shows up, put a claymores in these locations and you're going to see a lot of multi kills. So, Woo. Learn to come kicking in through the windows from the helicopter, so just kind of place these around a little bit. And I seem to think that uh, putting this one up here elevated just seems to help because when it blows up, it's going to go on both sides of that couch right there. I know. So that'll be pretty cool. So just keep placing these things around, and in no time at all, these guys are going to show up, and they're going to walk into your uh, wealthy devised plan. <laughs> and you're going to get more of those multi-kills. Pretty much the wave starts, as you can see, it's just boom, 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 boom. Just multi-kill stacking all up. Look, watch this one right here. Oh, that's right. Mad skills. All right, now we, uh, I've got the VIP on the roof right here. Uh, there's going to be a grouping of enemies down here that you can throw a grenade at. And then two, as you kind of fight towards the helicopter, they're going to fall back towards the helicopter. So you can kind of chuck grenades in that general direction and pick up a couple more uh, multi-kills. I'd also recommend that before you go up there, you plant uh, one or two claymores up here. And then down there where those guys are at, plant a few more claymores. And it'll make uh, these next uh, multi-kills going to do a lot easier. But if you don't have the foresight for that, not a big deal because I'll show you how to get them with just grenades. All right, so now that you got this helicopter scene, there's gonna be a big wave of guys coming through the bottom, which is another uh, great opportunity for multi-kills. Also, there is the uh, weapon crate up there. So if you run a grenade, just go ahead and restock on them. As you can see, they're just kind of grouping up like a bunch of idiots. So uh, go ahead and take advantage of it. And then over here in this, uh, back there in that roof, if you were to put some uh, claymores up there before you got up there, they would have just all ran out into them and got a multi-kill. You can hear my son is trying to help me with my microphone. Oh, yeah. Woo! Uh, on the left-hand side, you're going to see uh, some more guys grouping up on that roof. Uh, they're not always going to be there in this order, but you can definitely take advantage of it when they do group. Just like I said, use your visor to watch the uh, arrow stack up and just kind of get a grenade in their general direction. So just real quick, throw one down. Woo! Later. And that guy can't hit nothing with a shotgun. Another multi-kill. I've already lost count, but there, this is already a ton of them. All right, so you've uh, worked your way out of the building now, and there's this helicopter coming over here. So fight your way down, clear a hole, and then the helicopter's going to hover over the Tree of Life. Awa! Avatar reference, but uh, go ahead and throw a few grenades out there. Bam, another multi-kill. I don't know what it is, but I like the single burst guns. Like it, all the way back to the old school uh, Medal of Honor series where you just had the M1 Grand. Blah, 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 chink.
How convenient, a ramp to run out of there. All right, and this is gonna be another series of events where you can get multiple multi-kills before it's all said and done. So your trophy should more than likely pop here. Um, this is my second run through in this level, just uh, doing nothing but optimizing, trying to get multi-kills for you guys. But as you can see right here, boom, multi-kill. Throw it on the corner, like if they're still grouped, you can get another one. There's only one that time. And pretty much every time you turn a corner, there's just gonna be multiple guys grouped up in an area somewhere. Oh yeah. But like I said, there's uh, obviously multiple opportunities to get this. Uh, don't get stuck on it if you uh, miss a simple one because you'll get another opportunity to get it. And as long as you have eight going into the final stretch, you'll be good to go because the last two kills are mandatory multi-kills because you're taking down a tank with C4 twice. Times two, deuces, squared, math problems. Hopefully we'll win in the audience that likes to watch that show. Crazy times, but yeah, here we go. Gonna blow up this tank here, get another multi-kill. Uh, it takes two of them. It takes two, baby, me and you. So go ahead and blow that guy up and then there'll be another tank that shows up here momentarily and we'll blow him up too. And then I'll just uh, render in the trophy pop from the other video. So uh, thank you guys for choosing Happy Thumbs Gaming. Check out our channel for more Battlefield 4 videos. If this video helped you out, don't forget to subscribe and like. Leave a comment if you have any questions. Remember, if you guys are trying to find our videos, just type HTG at the end of your search and we will always show up on top. As always, happy hunting gamers.